Uh, at the logistics center we are basically storing finished goods uh, mainly as well as semi-finished goods for the assembling line. We've got a month's worth of uh, stuff stored in this warehouse. The process is uh, slightly more uh, automated than before. The uh, more automated part is uh, in the shipping area where we put the uh, picked products into the uh, shipping base and managing the empty pallets again. Everything else is basically the same process as in the old one, just bigger scale uh, and more conveying system, of course. Yeah. Before we could operate the, the new part, we had basically deadlocks in the shipping area. We had uh, a lot of warehouses uh, rented around Zug and trucks were on the yard to unload the products we need to pick. But we couldn't unload them because we need to load first, but we couldn't load because the, the products weren't here yet. So it was a really deadlock situation. Uh, without this up, uh, logistics center, we couldn't be operating from here anymore. It wouldn't be possible. That's uh, the major uh, issue that you're capable of supplying all the markets. The Swiss market, of course, which is still the biggest, as well as uh, the other markets, the new markets we're, we're uh, going into now. Yeah. At VTUG we try to be energy neutral and uh, very efficient, as sustainable as possible. We've got uh, integrated solar panels in the south facade. Behind me you see these uh, sp sprinkled uh, windows. These are the solar panels. We recuperate braking energy of the cranes in the high bay warehouse, which generate about 20 kilowatts and uh, we also uh, re reuse the uh, heat of the uh, IT system uh, for heating the, the high bay warehouse. Mm -hmm.